Yo, welcome back, Zykor here. And today in No Man's Sky, uh, well, the uh, Desolation update hit, and it's pretty amazing. They've got a bunch of stuff in there. Um, the, like, derelict freighters that they added that you could randomly run into in space, and even the ability to color your own freighter, which is amazing. <laughs> and... Um, even, let's see, adding other, I mean, like, adding technology to your freighter seems to be a little bit changed a, a little bit. You can add it to the freighter's inventory rather than just in the technology slots, which is a little bit of a bonus. And you can also add a teleporter to your freighter. Aha, uh -huh, that's finally, <laughs> they, they should have done that a long time ago. So, let's check this out here. Now, they improved the lighting quite a bit, I think. The bloom is better. Uh, you can actually see lights glowing now rather than uh, just lighting is what it looks like. Um, they, didn't, they didn't fix my base. Uh, yeah, I've got problems in this base. I don't even... I shouldn't even be receiving that. I got damaged by something that shouldn't be in my base <laughs> and I still swim in my base yes yeah I, I hope something someday there will be something that fixes that plus I get I'm getting stuck yeah <laughs> uh, okay um, let's see here I'm gonna first I'll head up to my freighter because I might as well put a teleporter on my freighter why not and I'll check out the, um, changing the colors. As far as I know, I think it costs like 5,000 nanites to buy additional colors. So, I probably won't be able to get any right now because, I mean, I don't have 5,000 nanites. <laughs> I had almost 2,000, but I just spent like a thousand of them, uh, upgrading that, um, a rank multi-tool that I got uh, a long, long time ago. I'm not even sure when I got this multi-tool. Uh, let's see here. Uh, this multi-tool. Pillar of the Ancients. Yes. Uh, and I, I fixed it up. I had to install the scatter blaster, the shell greaser, and I even had to get the advanced mining laser in it. And I added a S, S rank analysis or not of analysis s rank scatter up scanner upgrade if i could speak and an s rank scatter blaster upgrade because why not yes so this should probably do a lot more damage than my other one my other one was b rank uh, actually let's check it out here uh, this one does like 4k Cap uh, damage capability is something like that. This one was, let's see, only 3,500. So yeah, this one should be a lot better. Button. Pillar of the Ancients. Yeah, 4,900. So this one should actually be better. Plus I have the upgrades in a little bit of a better order because it's better if you have them kind of on either side there rather than, uh, you know, you have this in the middle rather than up here. Okay. Let's head up here. First thing I want to do is add a teleporter in here because <laughs> uh, that's it's a, a amazing to have a teleporter in my freighter. It's something I've always wanted. Um, my ship's back. I don't have any fleet out yet. I probably should send my fleet out. I haven't been sending them out. So, get over here. Grab this. Always getting Gek Relics from that. There we go. Now, if I was to put a teleporter in, where should I put it? I should harvest this stuff while I'm at it. Sh 
shadows are quite a bit better in here. And as far as I know, you can access your storage boxes from inside your freighter inventory rather than... Let's see. There we go, yes. Storage container. Aha, that, yeah, that's a lot better. I'll have to rename these. Actually, y you can. Um, let's see. What do I want to name them to? This one I was going to name to, like, uh, plants. Let's see. This one I'll name... Yeah, just plants, maybe. Something like that. <laughs> there we go. Plants. And... Um, let's see. This one would be... Like... I don't know if I want to say minerals. It's not necessarily just minerals. It's... Um, elements. Or not no, it's not elements. What would this be? I'm trying to think of... I kind of forgot what was the name of it. Oh well. Elements, anyway. <laughs> I can always rename it later. And then this one is just kind of random junk. <laughs> Let's see. Uh... It's mostly these things, which is a curiosity. So let's just say curiosities, I guess. Curiosity. Should I do ease? Uh, curiosity. Maybe something like that. I'll leave it like that, maybe. That's probably better. Oh, yeah, I gotta put that Gelk Relic in there. Oh, and I forgot to put the... Yeah. Where's that Gek Relic? Where'd it go? Gek Relic. Oh, there we go. My inventory's so big, I can't see it. Get in here. Put all this stuff in here. There we go. Oh, I should put up a galactic trade terminal as well. Because I don't really... Uh, I could use to sell stuff from my freighter. Now, um, let's see. I could put the teleporter like right here. I mean, why not? Let's see. Tech. Teleporter. So I need metal plating and carbon nanotubes. That's pretty easy to do. So I should be able to get metal plating. Four metal plating. And two nanotubes. There we go. Just put it right here because that makes it easy access. There we go. Finally, I can teleport to my freighter. That is really nice. Yes. Why does it say it's unpowered? Or, that's weird. <laughs> that's that's odd. Let's see. Oh yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. I wanted this so long to be able to teleport to my freighter. Finally, it's able. I'm able to. I need to finish some of these quests from these guys too. I'll have to do that. Uh, especially the agriculture. And I can grow some more stuff. Okay. Um, let's see. Heading up to the... The... What is it? The bridge here. I believe there's a... Terminal to be able to modify the... The look of the freighter. Where is that? Manage fleet. Upgrade console. Upgrade... Freighter upgrade control access, select upgrade path, purchase upgrades, customize appearance. Let's see what this does. Okay, so I can't get any colors. 
yeah, I, I have to buy them all. It's not fair. Uh, so this is, it's like, um, did it, I think I saw somebody say that it, if you bought one here, it'll buy the second one too, maybe? I'm not sure. But still, 5,000 nanites for, like, all of this. Unless it's like five thousand, unless it's five thousand nanites for this one, and it purchases this one and this one as well, it could do that. But I want to be able to change the color of my freighter, so I need to at least get um, nanites. I'd like to get green and black because uh, those are my favorite colors. If you can't tell by my character. <laughs> okay, so I'll have to try that, but. I want to try the derelict freighters in this one because, for one thing, it says they'll give, it can give a large amount of nanites. And I thought, hey, let's see how many nanites I actually get because I only have 1,000 nanites now. I made a little bit back by just, what was it, selling something? Actually, I haven't uh, uploaded any of my discoveries either. I mean, I, I don't play online right now. Um, <laughs> I was tempted to for the desolation update because uh, some of the stuff they did is pretty interesting and you know I haven't actually played online because the last time I actually played was in Next and the online play really wasn't that good at that time it was really basic. Okay, let's head to the anomaly. Come on, select the anomaly, please. Come on. There we go. Okay, almost here. Now, supposedly, uh, Iteration Helios is supposed to maybe give a free um, item that it's an emergency broadcast receiver. It's supposed to possibly, uh, like, allow you to find a derelict freighter every... Uh, you can get, like, one free one a day. Um, I'm not sure if that is, is available to offline people, but uh, we'll see. So... Where is Helios? I think he's over here. If it's not available, then I'll probably just head to the uh, space station and check that out there because there's a new NPC in the space station that uh, basically sells it for five million, I think it's supposed to be. Okay, hello Helios. Are you gonna sell me anything or give me anything? You're so tired, young one, leave me to rest, please. Okay. So, he's not available to offline people. That's that's sad. Unfortunate. I'm disappointed in you, Helios. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's head to the space station. Um, I think I'm in Sa Sahiku right now. Actually, let me check out this quick. Right. Over here. I'm gonna check out the multi-tool guy, see what upgrades I have for this multi-tool, because this multi-tool seems pretty good. It's not a, like an exotic or, or exotic? Maybe no, experimental or alien. Experimental and alien ones seem to be the strongest. Okay, optical drill. I probably should get that for my uh, advanced mining laser, but <laughs> oh well. Otherwise, uh, there's nothing much. I do have a geology cannon in this one, so maybe I should actually utilize it. Okay. Let's just head out here to the space station. I'll just teleport there. And check the guy that gives or sells the emergency... What are they? Emergency broadcast receivers. Okay. Um, let's see. Sahiku. Current system. I might as well just stay in Sahiku right now.
Okay. Now, the guy that sells these is over here. Scrap dealer. Okay. Let's see what he does. Scrap dealer headlud? <laughs> the geck beams as I approach their ramshackle trading post. They brush aside a strange collection of wires and give me their full attention. So he's eager to sell. Do you feel brave, traveler friend? Good. Be bold. Seek profit. We will prosper together, I think. Acquire coordinates. Ask what they are selling. Let's just do that quick. Large ships suffer strange fates, friend. But their cargo is very valuable. Lots of profit to be had for the brave. Okay. The gecko waits my decision. Well, I guess I have to spend five million. He kind of is overpriced on that, but oh well. New item recorded catalog. Emergency broadcast receiver. To use it, locate the receiver in the inventory. Tune the signal with E. Okay, so basically, you just use it. That's what, uh, that's a low rank. Oh. Uh, these are all low. I'm still looking for like an S rank uh, freighter. Or S rank anything, uh, to be honest. Because actually, this ship is a little too small <laughs> for what I need. Okay, let's check this out. Let's see what happens. Do you use this in space? Hmm. I wonder. Let's use it in space. Well, uh, you know what? Maybe it's a good test. Let's just use it on the space station and see what happens. Emergency broadcast receiver activated. Tuning. Return to your ship to begin the search. Okay. Active the pulse driving to pulse drive to begin the tuning process. Active? Uh, I, I think they <laughs> they kind of messed that up. Okay, where should I pulse drive to? Um, where's a good place? Well, let's pulse drive over there. Searching frequency, listening on emergency broadcast channels. Slow down to intercept the sender. Okay. Land on the derelict freighter. Okay, so this is this is cool. So where do you land? Probably up at the top here. That's what it looks like. Yeah, I see a landing spot there. Now there's supposed to be things like biological horrors in here. You gonna let me land, please? There we go. Weird, it wasn't let me letting me land for a minute there. Yeah, there's supposed to be like new kind of biological horrors in here and like um and what are they? Uh turrets? Gun turrets? Game not saved aboard derelicts. Oh nuts. I didn't save before I left the space station. Ah, uh, let's see if I die. In here. Hopefully I don't. Is there anything else that left to explore out here? Can you run around on here? I mean like, can you jump off? I don't know as if I'm willing to try. <laughs> uh, falling off into the abyss of space. Jetpack disabled. Oh, okay. Derelict ship exhibits gravitational anomalies. Jetpack temporary disabled. Oh, okay, I see. Uh, I don't see anything else hanging around here. So it looks like just going inside is what you gotta do. So let's head inside. There's already a helmet a fallen person or thing or alien uh, my torch doesn't really do much uh, my flashlight it's, it's called the flashlight in the, in the US here I know uh, 
European is torch. Door control. Okay. I need to proceed with caution. What's this? Is this something? No destination terminals available. Network reactivation required. So that's like a teleporter? That's what it looks like. Ah, I'm cold in here. Nuts. Claim supplies. New item recorded. Ferrite dust. Oh, do I have enough space? I have some. Oh, nuts. I'm gonna send these to my ship. Because... Just in case. Uh, I need to get that teleport receiver on my freighter. Then I can actually send stuff to it. Well, I don't know if I would be able to right, uh, from this distance, but we'll see. I should I should do that sometime. Okay, I hope I have enough space. Wait. Oh, does this disappear after? Huh. A single-use receiver that scans for distress signals and freighter frequencies. Okay, so yeah, it must disappear after you're done with the freighter. Okay, hopefully I've got enough spaces here. Docking bay control. Severe incident. Total lockdown. Access denied. No crew life signs detected. Crew manifest and captain's log may assist in incident diagnosis. Cargo integrity, 95%. Salvage and recovery likely. Access doors have been automatically sealed and internal systems disabled. Manual restart required to begin recovery. Restart internal gravity. Gravity calibration error. Freedom of movement reduced. Internal environmental protection is offline. Attempt manual generator restart. Restart hazard control. Primary heat generator failure. Unable to restore primary heat control. Protection against extreme cold temperatures required. Nuts. <laughs> Emergency fabrication unit available. Access supply cache. Collect emergency supplies or unsealed door. One active receiver. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Well, let's... Emergency supplies. Supply cache consumed. Additional supplies can be collected within the airlock. Manual control is finalized. Begin door seal override procedure. Ah, okay. I got to do both. Okay. Seal irreversibly compromised. Let's switch to my scatter blaster here. Door seal removed. Proceed with caution. Your know, freighters are hazardous, I mean, dangerous environments full of environmental hazards and hostile entities. Okay, valuable salvage as well as special items that can be exchanged aboard spa a space station. So I need to locate terminals with the analysis visor. Okay. Collect data from terminals to learn the fate of the crew. Use the scanner to highlight loot within the current room. Claim highly valuable technology from the engineering core. Okay. So basically, analysis visor, use the scanner and get to the engineering core and just check out the fate of the crew with the terminals. Okay, I bet that's a terminal over there. Okay, so let's check out the scanner in here. So there's some, and there's some. Uh, let's go to the one closest to us here. Scavenge. Projectile and ammunition. Uh, okay, that's good. What about this? Can I access this? Nope, nothing. Okay. Interesting how they put you into like a, a third person uh, FPS type uh, view. Wasn't there some... And it puts your gun away when you, uh, or your multi-tool away I should say, when you dash. Oh, there it is. I was wondering where it is. You're gonna... There we go. Nanites! Yes! Ooh, 187 nanites. Not bad. Okay, so no other places. Ah, uh, nope. Wait. Uh, 
I had 107 ammo a second ago. It reloaded, and now it's a 96. Huh. Okay, so... Doorway. Okay, so I need to use the heaters. Analysis visor to find the heaters. Okay, uh, I need to recharge my... Good thing I've got plenty of sodium. Okay. That... Okay, the doorway is here. What is that? I can't tell if those are aggressive or not. But they are... a target. Is there any heater in here? Because I'm... There's a heating unit right over there. Okay, I can do that. Records terminal detected. Use F. Captain's log recovered. Engineering unit salvaged. Zones map. Two out of eleven. Okay. Let's reactivate the teleport terminal. There we go. Now I can teleport here. Maybe teleport back to my ship, too. Let's check the records terminal. Records terminal accessed. Searching. Emergency transmission records. Encrypted. Navigation charts encrypted. Crew manifest accessible. Access for crew manifest. Crew status as of last ship-wide bioscan 13 days ago. Command officer Captain Spato. Deputy officers Watch Officer Liao, Lieutenant Gograti, and Cadet Rus Ruskayu. Crew status report: Crew living, 110. Crew infected, 118. How can wait? How many? Uh, wait, what? <laughs> how can there be more infected than what's living? <laughs> I guess the ones infected didn't make it. Entity Gray, Mining Prospector. Uh, something's attacking me. Update bioscan. Scanning ship for biological traces. No detected biological traces. No trace matches crew records. Retrieving last known crew positions. Captain Spotto. Redacted area. Uh, Leo, weapons control one days ago. Gogradi, main generator one days ago. Cap uh, Ruskow, right, uh, Captain's Quarters one days ago. Okay. Rare item found. Crew manifest. The document would be highly valuable to those concerned with the fate of the missing ship. Okay. What's firing at me now? Is there anything firing at me? It felt like something was firing at me. Automated security. Okay, all of this is loot? Oh, wow. What is that? Log snippet? Ah, okay. So let's get this. New item recorded. Neural duct. Okay, so those things are aggressive. Okay, so you have to actually scan to get these things. Where are you firing at me from? There we go. I might as well just get this one too. Where is it? Did I just destroy something I shouldn't have? Nuts, I hope I didn't. Where's the heater? Heater? Where's the heater? Oh, nuts. Did I destroy the heater? Get over here. Heating. Heating. Huh. Oh, that's nice. Whew. There we go. Okay. Depressurized capsule. Steel reinforced. 
Wait, what? Do I need to use my mining beam? Is that something I should have done? I don't know. Well, let's check this. Log snippet. Ship AI log decrypted. Location tracking. Report of entity ooze. General hand. Personal bioscan last detected six days ago in the I A AI coolant chamber. 16 other present. Biometric readout indicates internal foreign mass. No other life signs. Okay. Rare item. Records indicate it was last used 13 days ago. This thing's hurt. Can I access this? Oh, okay. You don't need to uh, use your scanner for these then. Just need to use your scanner to see them. This one. This is a heating unit as well. Okay, this is another log. Partial crew equipment record follows. Engineering entity uh, Niskivius. Special. Ground team. Personal locker contains plasma clips, replacement glass, vial of acid, and a collection of life form photographs. Last access six days ago. Detailed scan reveals the locker was sealed from the inside. Sealed from the inside? How could it have been sealed from the inside? What could have happened? I honestly don't know. <laughs> so what is this? I have no idea. That's another heater. There we go. Okay, so did I get everything in here? Wow, this is all stuff. I got that one. Just gonna loot everything. There we go. Now I think I got everything. Okay, which way? To the right or to the left? Is there anything else? That's a doorway over there. The heating unit's there. Doorway down there. And that is records terminal. Previously recorded, okay. Anything else that I missed in here? Oops. <laughs> oh, there's one standing up straight. I didn't see that. There we go. I think I got all these. A Viking dagger. Not bad. I don't think I got this one. Lots of loot in here. Wow. A oh, head all core? Wow. That's not anything. Okay, I think I got everything now. I hope I did. Let's head through here. Okay. Get that. There's a heater in here. Okay, so this is kind of just a dead end. Okay, head this way. As far as I know, all of these are procedurally generated as well, and I have that habit of clicking, you know, when I shouldn't. Oh, there's something there. Let's check this. Oh, nuts. My inventory is almost full. <laughs> oh. Uh, am I going to be able to come back to this? Ah, uh, you need to come into these with, like, an empty inventory. And 
Nahat. Scanners. Okay, so those are defense turrets. No! I missed. There we go, got that one. Use it as a shield. No. Get out of there. Haha, -ha, got it. Oh, there's another one. Nuts. Um, is there a heater over here? I can read the log. Personal data recording, access, access for operator entity Yalian. Cargo loading, data stamp. 2,159. Auto transcribing audio. Just keeping the witnesses in the brig. Need to move fast. They're in the airlock, but recording ends. Okay. Yeah, I don't. I don't actually. I don't know if I've finished what I was saying before, but uh, the um, oops, <laughs> the stories for these are all procedurally generated, as far as I know. So it's actually pretty interesting and cool that they just decided to make procedurally generated storyline. Ah, uh, here we go. Got this. Starship shield module. You need... Ex that's actually something useful to come here with. Uh, a... Uh, like... A hauler? <laughs> with a lot more slots? Yeah. And an empty inventory. Oh, nuts. Uh, I'm not going to be able to get all this stuff. I might be able to come back to this one, though. I do really like the increase... Uh, increases they did to the weapon. Oh, nuts. Pulse engine module. Let's see. Did I get that one? No, not yet. Nanites! Yes. Guess I'll get this. Turn on the heater. Stand here for a second. Scan. Okay, there's all this. Wow, there's a lot of loot in these. Oh, I got that one. I'm not going to go that way yet. Gecknip! Okay. Is there anything else? I think I got everything. Or did I not get this? I didn't get this one. It's almost, this is almost like a heater, but it's not. It's just a light. Okay, let's stand by the heater, recover our... My... Temperature. There we go. At least the, the thermal uh, recovers pretty fast. Okay, this is down. No! Whew. That just came out of nowhere. Let's check out this area quick. Photon cannon module. Why can't I? Come on, let me through. Why can't I get through there? I can't. No. Well, I can't. 
Unstable canister. I can't get over there. Why won't it let me? I can't get all that loot, no. It won't let me get through. Why? That's not fair. Is it the same bug that I've been having? Not able to get through places? Okay, well, let's see. Next place to go. There's a doorway over there. And a way to go down right here. Let's get temperature stabilized. Okay, so let's see what's at this door over here. Okay, so this... Oh, there's log snippet here. Expedition event log follows. Data stamp. 2390.5. Refueling the ruling system. Refueling in the ruling system when ambushed by hostile starships. Ejected and detonated fuel pods, destroying enemy vessels. Claimed bounty with local authorities. Data stamp 2423.9. Sector peaceful. No hostile forces encountered. Data stamp 2440. Expedition weapons. Defense systems overwhelmed during pirate ambush in the Afugat I forget sector. Heavy fire taken. I'm hoping that the majority of these just give me nanites because I'm running out of store uh, uh, inventory space. Units, nanites, and units. Okay, uh, is that it for this little section? I got those two. Okay. Head over here, down that path. You run a little bit slower in here. Okay, let's... Oh, yeah, let's... Cover the heat. I heard something over there. I heard something over here. Ooh, I should have taken the ladder. What? I got damaged just by stepping off the ladder? Let's just peek around the corner. Okay. Anything here? No. Okay, let's check this door. Okay. Okay, there's some more fence units in here. Something fired at me. Well, at least my shield works. Unstable canister, I'll save that for... Okay. And there's a heater over there. Heater there, teleport terminal, and secure mainframe. Okay. Haha. <laughs> I love the, sh uh, the fire speed of that now. That is very nice. Uh, the improvements to the weapons are, are a lot, uh, a lot better. Okay, let's get this heater activated. And I have to say, the scatter blaster is amazing for this. Get this heater activated. No! Where is it? If I hit that unstable canister, it wouldn't surprise me if it blow this whole thing up and I'd screw everything up. <laughs> okay, let's check this. Private mainframe access denied. Captain's DNA required to access personal log. 
Shipwide bioscans indicate severe incident, I mean, incident status. Override available. Indicate captain's fate to begin. Indicate at captain's fate? That's... Well, I assume I'd say deceased because there, nobody's left alive on here. But, I mean, I guess unknown. Because I don't really know. Let's just say unknown. Input accepted. Log will record Captain's fate as unknown. Presumed dead. I guess. That's all you can really say. You don't really know. Duty officer may take command. Authenticate as duty officer to continue. Security credentials required. Log in as Cadet Ruskayu. Credentials accepted. Welcome, Cadet Ruskayu. Log will record you as temporary commander. Last significant entry from Captain Spato follows. Read Captain's log. Data stamp 1410.8. Damaged sentinels must have uh, must be harvested. They must be brought to the garden, so we sweep. Data stamp 1454.5. The drones can be close to the Atlas in this on this world. Their bodies remember flying, walking, functioning. They sit still on the anomalous soil they dream. Data stamp 1455.7. The garden world is full. Its seeds now spout sprouting. The machine wakes. It is time for us to move on. Data stamp 1417.7. Ehu. The Aeron child follows us. Even now, a swarm of memories floating from system to system. It remembers who cared for it. It remembers Corvax always. So we garden. So we find the fallen. Okay. Rare item found. Captain Spato's log. Highly valuable. Okay. Um, I might have to dump some stuff. Eh. Yeah. Um, what could I dump? I mean, these are nanites, but it's really low nanites, so I could dump these. Uh, otherwise... Wow, I've got a lot of ammo. A lot of ammo. Um... I, I don't need that. Uh, discard. Should have sold that. <laughs> living slime. Well, you know, I can put the living slime in here. Refine that while I'm at it. Drop pod coordinates. I should have used that one time. No! Had to reload! Huh. Okay, I'm by the heater. Where else now? Get this stuff. Rare item found. Ooh, trumping, trunk of the humming herbs. Okay. Data log. Partial crew equipment record follows. Name analysis entity Verskif. Specialism. Cargo loading. Personal locker contains spare boots, vial of acid, cost durer, and miscellaneous small paintings. Last access six days ago. Detailed scan reveals a rhythmic tapping is emanating from the locker. Huh. Strange. I guess I could dump the unstable plasma. <laughs> unstable plasma could be used, though. Did I read this one? Partial crew re equipment record follows. Name operator entity Edile. Specialism atmosphere maintenance. Personal locker contains wiring kit, secure wallet, sample bag, and assorted archived holograms. Last accessed two days ago. Detailed scan reveals the locker has unusually high internal temperature. OK. 
Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna have to really... <laughs> so there's a doorway there. Heater over there. I think I got everything in this room, didn't I? I think so. Well, let's just head through here. This is area four. Oops. Yeah, my, my habit of clicking. Okay, well, let's head through here. Okay, so that's a way down. Was there another direction over here? Did I come from this direction? Yeah, I came from that direction. Ah, oh, let's see what's over here quick before heading down to the next level. This looks like a... stuff in here. And reinforced seal. I don't know what you get for destroying that. I don't even know if I'm supposed to destroy it. Partial crew equipment record follows. Operations entity is Zen. Yet. General hand. Personal locker contains power hammer, medical supplies, replacement servo, and assorted torn up letters. Last access five days ago. Detailed scan reveals microbe colony is consuming locker contents. Hey, <laughs> microbe colony? That means it's <laughs> got a bunch of. Oh, um, like. <laughs> how nuts. My inventory's full. No. Let's see what I can dump. Um, well, you know, I can refine Haddle cores to. There we go. Got one nanite off that. And, and of course... Nanites! Haha! -ha. Hey, I can... Yeah, I can... I can do this. Get nanites off those. There we go. Made a little bit of space. Not enough, though. There we go. Cleared up a little bit of room. You can just refine the living slime and stuff. Okay. Whoa, that's spinning. <laughs> Okay, I think I need to go back out of here. And of course, my thermal protection. Is there a heater? Get the heater activated, come on. No. Okay. Let me pass that spinning box. <laughs> Partial cargo manifest follows. Nip nip buds, 860. Barrels of liquid, 9. Thermic condensate, 391. Simulated consciousness clip, 18. Cargo alert active. Okay. Let's try this one. Oh, I previously recorded that one. Okay. I did this one already. Yeah, the micro colony. Okay. Let's get this one. Did I get everything? Or is this the one I missed? Yeah. Hypnotic eye. Okay. Let's find this hypnotic eye. I think I can. I hope. Living slime. Do that for now. 
Go down here. Oh, I fell. <laughs> okay, what's in here? Okay, I, any of this could explode. <laughs> Duct. Get that. And I'll head on to the next area. And of course, my inventory is full. Eh. No. Okay, what can I dump? <laughs> Head our cores. Well, you know, I don't need these. They're nanites, but, uh, oh well. Yeah, I'll have to. Well, I guess I could dump salt. I don't need salt. Yeah, salt is easy to get on my planet. There we go. And these are, yeah, I could probably get rid of them, too. Okay. Of course. You need to come here with, uh, like, an empty inventory. So, I guess, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to get rid of some of this stuff. There we go. That's done, but I have to... I guess I'll have to dump these upgrade modules. They're nanites, but I don't have any... I mean, I can get rid of the unstable plasma, I guess. I think I can make some. Let's get uh, this. There we go. Just more <laughs> upgrade modules. Get this over here. And I guess I can... There we go. Okay, did I get everything? Nope. Okay, that's probably everything. Heading on. Let's get back by heater quick. Okay. Go to this heater. And I'll just... Okay, that was pretty easy. Read that. Watch officer's daily report, discipline, timestamp 2583.5, work entity, Narogonyi, cargo loading, confined to the brig for smuggling offenses. First offense, sentence length, 56 days. Okay. Anything else around here? Actually, this room didn't have much in it. There's a door there. And some stuff over here. Oh, I came this way, didn't I? Yeah, I came from that way. Okay. Door there and door there. So let's see about this door. This looks like continuing on. That's the engineering core. What's over here? Okay. And I can't get past this. Okay, well, I guess I can't get past it. 
I don't know why. And I'll... Oh, I've got full. Okay, head over here. Almost done here. Ah, uh, there's that. That is probably one of the new things. One of the new horrors in here. No! Is there a heater? Oh, right there. Okay, uh... My inventory's full. <laughs> uh, let me take a second to uh, deal with my inventory. <laughs> okay, got my organ uh, storage organized a little bit here. It's got a few spots open. So... Um, did I check this one? Doesn't look like it. AI, sh I mean, ship AI logging fragment. Three, uh, 392.72 recovered AI internal memory encrypted decrypting. Output follows. Probe report for AI control officer Rickesp. Re -ex existing gut fauna. Extremely low internal electromagnetism. High immune functionality average. Conclusion. Continue monitoring. Leave. Okay. Might as well get this. Let's check this one out. Partial cargo manifest follows. Liquid explosive, ni 969. Unremarkable crate, 6. Cryo pump, 154. Clone diplo eggs, 11. Status unknown. Okay. Depressurized capsule. Those look like some weird things. that. Nanites. Always welcome nanites. Okay. I think I came from that direction, didn't I? Oops. My habit of clicking. Yes, I came from this direction. Okay, so... Let's see if I can get this. Anything over here? No. That, this, loot, everything. Got a bunch of stuff. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's check with F around here. See if there's anything else. Because I don't know what's going to happen when I do this. Might as well activate the teleport terminal. There we go. So, let's see what happens. This is the engineering control panel. Engineering control panel accessed. Generator fall, uh, failure detected. Fabricators on emergency power. Construct component. Fabricate technology upgrade. Fabricate freighter bulkhead. Extract nanites. Oh, okay. So, yeah, that's right. Uh, you were able to select what you wanted to do for your freighter. You can pick, pick a technology upgrade or a bulkhead which expands your slots or get nanites. I think I'll do the bulkhead to expand the slots in my freighter because why not? We can check out what the fabricate technology upgrade some is another time maybe. Yeah, let's expand my freighter's inventory. Deployable bulkhead extraction initiated. Cargo removal complete. Nano compression complete. Portable storage unit ready for collection. Rare item found. Cargo bulkhead. Yes! Okay. All significant salvage retrieved. Use the derelict teleport network to exit quickly. Okay, so. New title unlocked. Scavenger Explorer. Yeah, that's right. They added titles as well along with this update, so that's kind of cool too. I should add one. Okay. How do you use the teleporter? Just get in it? 
Ah, okay. Teleported to emergency airlock. Okay, so... Activate caps of oxygen? Oh, I didn't know those were oxygen. Huh, I could have been getting those all along. Oh well, it's just oxygen. Okay. Well. Derelict freighters are pretty interesting. So let's head back to the space station quick. See what all I got. Because that should have been a lot. <laughs> Let's see what this stuff sells for. Find a buyer for the salvage. Offload the crew manifestation. Find interested buyers on the space station. Oh, let's see if that left. Okay, so yeah, that, that detector left. Okay, let's see. Let's get over to the space station. Let's see how much this stuff sells for. Where is the space station? Space station, where'd you go? There we are. Get back to the space station. Okay. Just get inside, not crash into the space station. <laughs> and we'll see what this sells for. I didn't read what it said. Offload the crew manifest. Scrap dealers and guild envoys offer different rewards. Okay, so the scrap dealer will take it, or the guild envoy will take it. Hmm. I bet the guild envoy will take for standing. And the scrap dealer will probably be like nanites. Ah, uh, what's better? Standing or nanites? Let's go for the... I mean, I don't need—I don't know for sure. So let's just check it out. See what the scrap dealer gives me. Can I always do another one, uh, another time here? And see, friend has information. Yes, I can smell it. We wish to make a trade. I have many nanites. Sell crew manifest official record. So yes, it's going to sell for nanites. What if I pick leave? Let's see what the uh, guild envoy says. I landed on top of this guy's spaceship. Let's, let's just see if I can uh, get the option over here and see what this does. Friend, you are honorable, trusted, good friend with the Gek, yes. You will do the right thing and trust us with what you know. Donate crew manifest re official record. Okay, so yes, it's either nanites or standing. Well, sorry to Gek, but right now, I want nanites. <laughs> I do. I mean, you know, I want the nanites so that I can get the um, colors on my freighter. Because that's what I want. Okay. Let's get these nanites. Let's see how much we get. Oh, nuts. Let's see how many I have first. I want to see. 2694 nanites. Actually, I got a lot off that. I got like a thousand nanites just roaming around in there. Okay. Sell it. How much did I get? And I got 300 nanites for that. Eh, not bad. Gives me the 3,000 nanites. <laughs> just under. One under. That, that, that bugs me. Okay. Um, let's see. Where do I sell the rest of this stuff? Um, let's see. Sell. Captain's log sells for 910. Highly valuable to those looking for information about the last days of the doomed vessel. Hmm. Repair kit. That sells for 54k. Can be oh these are repair kits yeah can be applied to any damaged subcomponent in place of the usual requirements actually those should be kept you never know when you're gonna need them cargo bulkhead I want to keep that upgrade my freighter descented pheromone bottle hey 29k for those 
lucrative trading opportunity for those willing to deal with the waste products. Well, they're selling for plus 58, so yeah, I'll sell that for now. Okay, so that's pretty cool. And this... Eh, only 600k. That wasn't that much. But, oh well. I'll sell it. And... Neural duct. Woohoo! That was, that's a lot. Those sell for a good amou amount. And storm crystals. Uh, you know, maybe I'll keep those for now. Those could come in handy. Okay, I'm not sure where this captain's log is sold. Let's see uh, if the guild will see or will give me anything for the captain log. Oh, okay, so the scrap dealer also wants the captain's log. Well, let's see what... I didn't know that. Okay, let's see what uh, he gives me for the captain's log. Okay, it looks like you have to talk to him twice. Maybe? Or is that a bug or something? Let's see. Ah, friend, brave traveler. Such a priceless item you hold, but no. Friend, nothing is priceless. Do you wish for nanites? Okay, sell captain's log, official record. That gave me... 500 nanites. Woohoo! Well, that's nice. Not bad. It's pretty good. So yeah, uh, these derelict freighters are a good way to make some nanites because I just went from, I think I had like, what was it? I had 1,000 nanites and I just made 2,500 nanites from that. Not bad, not bad at all. And not to mention that I did have to drop some of these uh, modules. So yeah, that would even be a little bit more even though they are C rank. Let's see what they sell for. Come on. You gonna let me in? Purchase, sell. So 116, eh, not bad. So sell, 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 and sell. Some of them were 60, but still, I almost got 4,000 nanites. So yeah, I got like almost 3,000 nanites off that. Not bad. That's pretty good. Okay, well, this has been a very interesting outing here. I love the derelict freighters. They're pretty cool. Uh, good source of uh, nanites and uh, units and other items. Pretty cool stuff. And uh, interesting story-ish. That that one seemed like it was a. Uh, there was like something that happened to the crew, like an infection or something. I'm not fully sure. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. This is really cool what they did with this. I like it. So, if you like this episode, hit that like button. I really appreciate it. And it really helps me out a lot. It helps us out a lot because that includes Trison. And uh, leave a comment. Subscribe as well. And yeah. Uh, share it as well, of course. And yeah. Thanks for watching. Prior to the rather long episode. And I'll see you next time.